more video footage of these fine young ladies. The, most of the girls are three to fives. Uh, I've seen a couple six and most of them are three to fives. They're aged in their right ear and and they and put a palpate date or calving how many months they were bred when they palpated them. So what they did, they have a group of later winter calvers, later a later fall and winter calvers. They sorted the heavier, the early fall slash summer calvers off the deal. So these are the early fall slash summer calvers here. They're all basically they're they're, they're Brangus, a few Brafords in here, a few Baldies in here. The quality's gonna be good. You know, if you if you got to want these, there's five or so of these nice beef master cross yellow cows. You know, she's a She's three years, probably the calf now. She was a three year old when they palpated her. Seven months pregnant when they palpated her, I'm sorry. So she probably has a calf somewhere. Calf wise, look, they are out there, so. Six months bred and they palpated her. So that was in April, so lights are already cat. I think there's about 10 babies on them. Cattle are very gentle. Break down where we are, we're outside of Kendall, Louisiana. This pasture was a rice field just four or five years ago, so it still kind of holds some water and it'll be getting lots of rain. So, she probably has a camp by now, too. Uh, she's gonna spring it up, baby. Again, looks like there's about 10 babies on them. They had Angus and Charlotte bulls on them so far. There's about yeah, one yellow baldy calf over there off that black baldy cow, so Charlotte daddy. And it brings cows, I think it's baby. So there's about uh, nine of these. So the bull breakdown they had two Charlays, two Angus, and one Hereford. Looked like that Brangus cow over there that Hereford got her. So I'm going to video their mates in just a little bit that are the, the fall slash winter calvers. These will be the late, the summer slash early fall calvers. Good quality here, good people. All these cattle are, are from this area. They can tolerate any heat, humidity. There's two, uh, she's an Angus cow, but she's that's a good hell of an Angus cow and raised in this area. The rest are another brand in the bar. Uh, she's pig fat and she there is one, two Angus on here, but that one just she's a rock star. It's really good for being raised in the marsh, basically. Good cattle getting there's like I want to see 10 babies on there stretched out out there. Kind of see what they work with. They're good young cows. They're full of baby and dropping them on the ground. Again, uh, majority of them are brangish, brangish baldies. Uh, nice young baldy brindle cow there. Nice three year old brave here. And I'm sure if somebody just wanted the blacks, I'm sure obviously there's a load of these. Heavy breads and black brangus pears here. A guy can just take those, I'm sure. So good cattle outside of Kendall, Louisiana. Cattle are very gentle, extremely low maintenance. Young as you want them. Most of these cattle are three to fours. Yeah, most of them are three to fours, you know, a few fives and sixes, but young as you want them. Cattle are making money. Here on the Texas Louisiana line. Hope you have a blessed day and call me. Can these girls be priced to sell, but they won't last long. Have a good day.